IPL5, we're at the Cosmopolitan of Las Vegas. I'm here with Shane Hendrickson, that's SK Rafa. How are you doing this morning, sir? Hey, I'm doing pretty good, uh, feeling good going into this game. Excellent, you've got the semifinal match coming up. You're representing SK Gaming. You're playing against Fnatic Raid Call with Lacame, EP, and Strengths. Uh, Strengths, I know you've got a little bit of a history with, mm -hmm. with Quake. Uh, do you want to talk about uh, you, know, you and Strengths as a, as a duo there? Uh, we've faced each other in Quake many times. Um, only once in a team play atmosphere, uh, but most of it just been in the duel. Mm -hmm. And uh, he's always been extremely talented as far as aim-wise. He's always been known as like an aim monster. Um, and you know, as of late, you know, he started to develop his mental game, and he became a very, very consistent player as far as like placing top three. Mm -hmm. um, it was always a threat to possibly win the tournament. And I think he's really transferring that well over to shoot mania, especially with his railgun. He's been doing really well with that, and. Uh, he's definitely got a different style I've seen than most other players, and um, yeah, I think the game caters to him pretty well. Yeah, Strengths uh, was actually showing some really, really good defense yesterday mm -hmm. on maps like the Castle. He seems to have just tons of hiding places and can uh, surprise attackers when they least expect it, but uh, you're, of course, prepared for that. I'm sure you watched all the games yesterday uh, and uh, the day before, actually, in the wild card mm -hmm. qualifier, so, you know, these guys, uh, they came to play. They have not dropped a match yet. That's, you know, pretty intimidating. They've taken out some really good opposition. Uh, you guys, of course, have been practicing a lot for this event. You were the invited team, and there was, you know, some controversy, you know, like, why are you inviting a team at all? You know, uh, mm -hmm. maybe you should have invited Fnatic. Why'd you invite SK? Uh, what do you think about, uh, you know, the invitation sort of uh, aspect of this? Well, I mean, I understood why you guys, you know, wanted to invite me and, like, get exposure to the game and stuff, and I knew, you know, once once I got that opportunity, I wasn't going to let it slip by. I was going to take it yeah. extremely serious, you know, so I, I wasn't worried about what other people said. I knew I would pick teammates that you know I thought would cater to the game well. That's why I chose uh, it and Clock because of their offensive CTF background and being creative and your your dodging and your movement, how you have to read players. Um, yeah, and I mean we've been playing a lot for the past I think seven weeks it is, and uh, yeah, I mean we've had our ups and downs, but where we're at right now for that amount of time compared to everybody else, like I'm. Really proud of what we've done, but I would be even more proud if we win today and get to the finals. For sure. And I mean, there's really no doubt anymore that your team was worthy of mm -hmm. the invitation. I mean, you got second place in the group against some great teams. Epsilon and Spin Move were both there, two of North America's best teams. Uh, got through past them, and uh, you're, you know, you're the only team that actually took any games at all off of Colwyn, which we just saw a great mm -hmm. performance out of in the first semifinal. So, uh, you know, perhaps if you do get to the finals, could be a rematch, as Colwyn's already waiting there for uh, the winner of your upcoming semifinal. Uh, how did you feel about the games yesterday? Well, Epsilon came out hot yesterday in the first game and I feel like you know we just weren't playing our game at the time you know I know I definitely choked a few times on offense I had good opportunities and I kind of let the team down but uh you know we just looked at it afterwards we're like all right well we're still not out of the tournament we just need to take it one game at a time focus on trying to beat spin move you know like look at you know the weaknesses we've seen and try to exploit them and just make sure that we're we're changing our game to the point where we're all effectively like either pushing all at once or playing collectively back and always working together like not making sure that nobody's left out to dry and um, as you can see like each map we started to get better and better and got stronger and stronger and um, I think the fact that you know, we've seen Colwyn, and we've been able to see games of them, and they haven't seen us play. Right. I think that kind of threw them off yesterday, like, with what we were going to do. And they didn't expect us to play the way that we did. And, um, yeah, I, th I thought we played really, really well. And I just hope that we could play that well together again today instead of just having one person being hot. You know, and the other two cold, we need to all be clicking at all cylinders. Yeah, really great answers. Thank you very much for this short interview. Thanks. I'm not going to ask you, you know, any strats or anything no, about no, this. I, uh, I don't expect you to. Yeah, and, uh, but I mean, I do wish you the best of luck. It's a best of five. It's a little bit longer format mm -hmm. than we had yesterday. So could be kind of grueling. I hope you're up to the task. We'll see how you play against Fnatic here in just a moment. Thanks very much. Yeah, Good luck, you. sir. We're going to take a short break right now. And on the other side, we'll be bringing on strengths from Fnatic Raid Call.